right. Hi, everyone. Welcome to another episode of the BOA uh, member, the BOA Board of Advisors Spotlight. Uh, my name is Sean Glavin, uh, class of 2006. Uh, really excited to uh, to have a very unique uh, BOA Spotlight today. Um, before we jump into it, I just want to give a quick background on the Board of Advisors for Nichols College. Uh, we are a community uh, of just about 70 esteemed Nichols alum or friends of the college that are seeking to provide growth opportunities for students, other alum uh, in the community throughout uh, through our time, uh, talent, and treasure. So really volunteering, uh, finding opportunities within our organizations for folks to thrive, uh, and then being able to really drive um, some donations uh, to help out with some specific projects on campus. So uh, that's the Board of Advisors. The Board of Advisors Spotlight uh, is uh, is built to, to allow the greater community to, to hear a little bit about what we're doing. Uh, I am thrilled uh, to introduce a uh, fellow BOA member, uh, Isabella Richard, a class of 2018, uh, who will help me uh, with today's spotlight. Uh, and also super thrilled, uh, again, I said this was a little bit of a different spotlight, uh, to, uh, to spotlight two folks uh, on the BOA. Uh, and that is Nicole Carnavale, uh, class of uh, 2024, uh, and Hayden Munz, class of 2026. Uh, Nicole and Hayden uh, are both recent Board of Advisor student representative um, positions that are, are brand new for this year. So uh, Nicole and Hayden, welcome. Thank you. All right. Well, uh, I will turn it over to Isabella to ask um, Nicole and Hayden their first question. Awesome. Well, thanks, Sean, for the great introduction. I mean, Nicole and Hayden, we're so excited to have you helping us on the board. So, Nicole, I'd love to hear about um, your involvement at Nichols. Yeah, absolutely. So, like Sean mentioned, I'm a part of the class of 2024. I'm a double major in hospitality and human resource with a minor of real estate. And I do kind of a lot of things here, but the main ones I do Student Government Association, the HR organization, and I'm also a part of the orientation team. Awesome. That sounds great. How about you, Hayden? Um, I am Hayden Munz. I'm from Berlin, New Hampshire. I'm currently a sophomore at Nichols. I'm studying entrepreneurship. I haven't declared any minors yet, but I have a few in mind. Uh, I'm involved in rugby, um, the, one of the clubs on campus. Uh, through that, I am the match secretary for that club. So I am scheduling all of our games, buses, uh, making sure that we are good hosts to other teams. And I am just happy to be here. Awesome. Thanks, Aiden. Great job. Great question, Isabella. All right, question number two. Uh, and Hayden, we won't let you off the hook. We'll let, we'll make you go first answering this question. Um, so Hayden, uh, tell us a little bit about your interest in being uh, a BOA student representative and the first one at that. Well, you know, uh, I've always admired the BOA. Um, I know a lot of students don't really know what it is, uh, but I mean, you can always see these alumni on campus. And I think I admire them the most because they're the alumni that have come back and wanted to support the students that are currently on campus. Um, through BOA, I'm hoping to expand my network, but also grow my skills, um, whether it be through uh, education or like I said, networking in general, you know, I really want to uh, be able to become a well-rounded student, whether that be through talking to other people, um, getting some insight on what career paths they've taken and what have you. Um, and what I want is I want every student to go through Nichols and want to come back and support the Nichols community after they graduate. You know, um, I was raised in a house of uh, culture, um, and servitude towards Nichols. You know, my parents were both alums and they've really instilled those values into me. And I want every single student going through uh, Nichols to really understand what I feel and understand how I grew up and want to give that back to the school after they're gone. Awesome. Well, thank you very much, Hayden. A uh, great answer. Uh, Nicole, how about yourself? Um, tell us a little bit about your interest uh, as far as being a BOA student representative. Yeah, absolutely. So as my time here as a student is coming to an end in May, um, I've been able to see within the past three and a half so years, the impact that alumni have on students and how much it's pushed me personally, as well as those around me. 
And I think being a part of the board of advisors or being alumni in general is that one next step to students' success here on the Hill. And it embraces them. It brings like the positivity out of them, their drive out of them. And like I said, come May, I'm that alumni. And being able to have that impact on the students here is so great that I couldn't see myself not being in a position like this or one similar to put an effect on all the students here. Awesome. Thanks, Thanks Nicole and Hayden. Um, and Nicole, I would love to know, so what are some of the things you're hoping uh, to accomplish in your last year as a Nichols student? Yeah, so, you know, looking back on the past three years and being able to kind of piece together all the little things I've done and finally bring it to a whole in my last year. Um, this last year, I just want to make the final impact that I can as a student, as a peer to the people that go to this school. Um, but I also am looking to take that next step to what it is going to be like when I leave and how I can impact the alumni in that sense and also the students as well. So just kind of in that transition period of, you know, how do I become a student and then go into the workforce and also still stay connected with the community that made me who I am. So working on that and just excited for when that comes around. Oh, that's so exciting. Um, it goes by fast, so in, enjoy it. Um, and Hayden, I know you have a little bit um, more time than Nicole, so would love to hear about what you're hoping to accomplish. Well, you know, I'm hoping to do some of the same things, you know, um, leave an impact on campus. You know, I I'm not in, involved in a lot of things on campus yet. Um, this is definitely a big step being this uh, student rep representative, of course, but I really want to be able to leave a a footprint on campus. You know, I want people to know maybe something that I did uh, that I did on campus that um, would keep impacting students for a couple of years at least. Um, but I'm really hoping to uh, find my path personally. Uh, like Nicole was talking about, the transition between being a student and being in the workforce and still connecting um, Nichols. In, the, in that career path, you know, I really want to be able to find my way, but be a supporting member of the school, similar to my parents. Um, I'm unsure on what I want to do yet, but I'm really open to any opportunity that presents itself because this is such a wonderful board and with filled with wonderful people and I would love to get to know all of them more. Well, that's great, Hayden. We, we look forward to having you on board. Yeah. Well, Hayden and Nicole, thank you so much uh, for your time today on the Spotlight. Uh, I'd also say, and didn't say it at the, at the front end, thank you very much for your decision to join the board. Um, you know, I'll speak for Isabella and the rest of the board. It, it gives us an amazing opportunity to, you know, to make a bridged connection between the work the board does and the, and the current student body and the current folks on campus. So, we really appreciate you. Looking forward to starting the work with you all. And, and thanks again for the spotlight. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you.